Hello fellow commanders, welcome back to some more Elite Dangerous. Once again, it has been a few days in between episodes. I apologize, uh, as you know, still finishing up with school, still finishing up uh, finals, final projects, all that good stuff. And, uh, yeah, so I haven't had too much time to record, or play, or really do much of anything. Uh, but today, oh, first things first, ow, I just realized my finger's bleeding. I actually jammed cardboard under my nail earlier when I was getting a soda out of the box. Ow. Okay, anyway. Today, first things first, uh, got some feedback on the purple. Uh, tried tinkering out with that a little bit. Now we're trying out this white and blue. I think I didn't do it correctly, or nearly correctly enough. Um, just because some things aren't working, like when you highlight an enemy, it's not... It's not putting them in a different color once you engage. Like, it's normally the default is red. So, trying this one out. I found some more online I'm going to try out. So, we'll probably just leave this one for this episode. And I'll change it in between next time. Because I just didn't feel like relaunching Elite Dangerous. <laughs> Maybe I'm just lazy like that. But I like that white and blue. But I've definitely seen it uh, executed a little bit better. But I suppose we should go over what we plan on doing today. I'm just randomly jumping. I felt like doing some exploring, so I set a destination. Fuel uh, let's pull out the galaxy map, actually. Do. All right, so current Fuel galaxy scoop. map. Uh, we're going quite a ways away, but uh, LHS three zero zero six, and now I'll tell you why I picked this. Let's check out the system view. Pull up a map for it. And what do we got here? What? We have a planet in the system, a lone planet in the system, Vulcan. And orbiting Vulcan is the Leonard Nimoy station. What's that? Fremont Legacy, huh? So, yeah, that's the main reason. I feel like this would be a good destination to kind of explore towards. Don't know what those yellow lines are, but yeah, we'll head over to Vulcan, go to the Leonard Nimoy station, I guess, I guess pay our respects. And we'll be stopping in at signal sources and whatnot along the way. Uh, probably not that one right there. Uh, hey, me and a friend are gonna go bounty hunting. We wanna join? No thanks, fellas. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go uh, find Leonard. The quest for Spock. Oh, <laughs> uh, which, which Star Trek movie was that? I can't remember. And it was one of the Star Trek movies. The quest for was it the quest for Spock? I believe it was. Uh, I don't remember what number it was. Oh, accidentally canceled my jump. Mm. Hello. That's something I've always meant to do. <coughs> is going back, oh, excuse me, and watch the original series of Star Trek. I, I've seen plenty of episodes. I've probably seen most of them over the years because my dad used to watch them. We had we had one on VHS growing up. It was um the Trouble with Tribbles episode. If you know what that is, a Tribble. I actually have one sitting on my desk. My roommate gave it to me a couple years ago. A Tribble is just like a little furry ball. And, uh, that's, ooh, that's a nice looking star. It's a little furry ball, and there, it was like an infestation. They found them all over the ship and everything. Uh, let's scan this sun. But yeah, that's what a tribble is. And so that was the one we had for some reason. It was trouble with tribbles. I should get a new scanner, because this thing is just taking forever. I'm probably not going to bother to scan all the suns we go by, unless we see, like, a really cool one. Yavapai. Yavapai, huh? That was... I believe that's the name of a dorm on my Feels college stupid. campus. I'm pretty sure it is. The dorm I stayed at was Manzanita Mojave. Judging. You'll never guess where my school is in the southwest with all these spanish sounding names. But I think Yav Yavapai was a, a dorm down the road from mine. Hmm. Four, three, I'm going to turn the gain of mine. Mic up a little bit. So it's currently Sunday. I should probably be keeping track of time. It's 3.03. Oh, I gotta go to work in two hours, so... I'll probably record at least one or two, depending on how long this trip takes, and whether or not I want to cut stuff out. Uh, do -do. Okay, we're now in Yavapai. Yeah, because originally I was just going to go do some dogfighting. Um, maybe go to the resource extraction site that we were by at the, uh, the Gibson uh, station, but that's a bit boring. I, I feel like dogfighting, I don't want to do two episodes of dogfighting in a row. Like, I definitely want to separate them. 
I think I think that's good playing because those are fun. Bounty hunting is fun. Um, I'd like to eventually get into piracy, so I'll have to get the thing where I can pull people out of jump drives. I like the in in uh, what's it called? Interaction? No. Interment? No. Uh, indicate? No. Whatever. The thing that allows you to pull people out of jumps and then you can uh, break into their cargo and steal their cargo. It is very frowned upon, but it seems like fun. Also, I think I want to eventually get an Imperial Clipper, just because that ship is super sexy looking. So I think I need to start aligning myself with the Empire, because you need to be a specific rank in order to get an Imperial Clipper. I forgot exactly what rank, but you know. You know what I mean. Uh, let's just go ahead and scan. One new astronomical object. Also, the writing seems a bit... Everything seems a bit fuzzy. I think that's another way I did the... I, I did the HUD colors incorrectly. But I'm a novice comma rank, peddler trade rank, mostly aimless. Chris, we have 1.6 million credits, it's pretty awesome. So we're, what, like a 24th of the way to getting uh, Imperial Clipper. We'll probably get a ship in between. Uh, maybe like a, um, a vulture or an asp. I'm not sure. What, what do you guys think? Do you, what do you think the next plan I should get is? Hey, it looks like uh, the, our sun. Looks like Sol. What do you think I should get? I'm not quite sure what I want to get. Um, I don't know. Something above the Cobra. Maybe, yeah. Like, I think the middle ones are like the Vulture and the Asp. And, uh... Not the Fertilance. That's another, like, top-tier fighter. I don't know. I could get a transport ship, like a Type 7 or Type 9. Not Type 7. I think it's Type 6. I forgot. There's a lot of types. Not very creative names. But... I guess for that kind of ship, you don't really need a creative name. Oh, wait, never mind. Trails high, far away from me. Cross paths, house trading. Oh. Yeah, people, people talk to me. I don't respond too much when I'm actually recording. I'll respond off camera and stuff. Let's see. How many how many jumps is it saying? Plus 12 jumps, so it's really not too bad. Oh, I keep forgetting to scan. I should probably eat some before I go to work. Oh, I did eat lunch today. I made uh, one of those frozen tombstone pizzas, and so I cooked it. I ate half of it in my room, and then the other half was just sitting on the kitchen counter, but then I got a text and I had to go run down to campus to help out with this uh, installation art project we're working on. And so I was just dropping something off, and I came back like 20 minutes later, and my pizza was gone. And there's so there's traces of pizza sauce on the floor, and there was cheese on my dog's nose. So somehow, he's gotten the height, and he knows that he is that height now, where he can get up to the counter and steal stuff. So he ate half of my tombstone pizza. Like it wasn't massive; it was just like a I don't know, like a 16-inch pizza. But I don't know. I was still kind of hungry, and he ate my pizza. A little bastard dog. He didn't even eat his dog food breakfast either, so he just ignored his breakfast all morning and then ate my pizza. I don't think he likes his current dog food. I've been I haven't been pouring water on it. I call it gravy. He likes that, but I haven't been doing as much because he's kind of getting spoiled. Whatever. Hmm. <laughs> I think I'm addicted to root beer. I've always said that. If they made a like an alcohol or even like a like a beer that tasted just like root beer, I'd cease to be to be productive in life. It's like my favorite beverage. That and like blue power rate's pretty good. And I, I like I like just plain water. People bitch about water, especially like here in Arizona. People say the water quality sucks. I like just water. I don't. I'll, I'll drink it cold. Like I like it with ice, but people just bitch about it. I think it's fine. I've never really had a problem like, oh, this water is disgusting. Two, we have people one, work bitch at that. I work at a restaurant and they'll be like, is this water filtered? I'm like, yes, it is filtered. We're like, oh, it's horrible. Like, oh, I'm sorry. It's fucking water. We live in a desert. What do you expect? Mm -hmm. Flip it around. Fuel Flip it around. I haven't seen any really cool suns yet. I'd like to find a black hole eventually. Because I know those exist in those, this game. Those would be super cool to find. What, what do we got here? Strong signal source. Alright, let's go check that out. 
Oh, we got someone right there. Hi there, buddy. Okay. Uh, we can go a little faster. We're at 10 seconds out. I'm liking the white and blue. I just wish, wish there was more blue accents. Um, I don't know. Maybe we'll just eventually go back to the orange. Because I do love the orange. I think it is the best looking one. I mean, it's how the game was, was designed initially. So, They obviously probably did that for a reason. But the purple was good. I don't know. We'll just mess around. Uh, let me know what you think about the white and blue. I'll probably be changed by next episode. Just because I like messing around with it. Different options. Whoa, disengage. We almost hit someone. <laughs> I was a bit close. Alright, what do we got? Uh, we got some type 9s. Okay, we are right on top of them. Hi there, buddy. Type 7s. Okay, and those guys are j probably going to be clean. Uh, where are these eagles at? Are these their escorts or are they uh, pirates? Let's go find out. Let's actually get our hard points out just in case and so we can scan them. He's clean. Uh, where's the other guy? Right there. Joe Rutledge. He's clean, okay. Let's go ahead and scan these guys, because like that one time we found that one wanted transport ship amongst the regular transport ships. And there's three people on the wing, and there's more than three ships, so we'll see. Clean. Okay, he's wanted. Oh, is he bugging out? Does he know I know? Okay, kill warrant complete. 72,000. Yeah, let's take him out. Can't run from me, punk. I, I have a question for you. I don't got time for you, Brunts. Alright, let's just catch up to him. Let's stay right on his ass. Time for me to be somewhere else. Yeah, you should say that now. Boss isn't gonna like this. Whoa! Hi there, buddy. What are you doing? Excuse me while I melt you. Tear you to shreds. Ow. Oh, that's fast. There we go. 72,000. Not bad. Uh, we scanned all the other ones, right? Uh, it was a Type 7 we haven't scanned yet. You better be clean, Dan Porter Brown. Alright, he's clean. Uh, it's Laura. We tracked our hard points. Oh, uh, what's space? Even? We're in Federation space right now. Um... Hmm. Uh, should we go find a station to... Yeah, we'll head over to Flip Flipchinko uh, City and go ahead and uh, collect that bounty. Frameshift drive charging. Frameshift drive charging. Um, yeah, we'll head over to this uh, platform station. And I'll catch up with you guys uh, once we're over there. Okay, and we are back in... Well, not back. We've never been here before, but Filipchenko City. I actually f made it into the slot first tie. I didn't have to search around the whole thing. Because uh, some people gave me tips like about where the arrows pop up. And uh, it always rotates towards... It always faces the body it's rotating, so... Yeah, it was much easier. Textbook landing and all that good stuff. Uh, context. Let's go ahead and look at security. 33,000? What? But didn't the guy we just kill, wasn't that worth 70,000? Or was that not for the Federation? Um. 
Oh, it might have been Empire Alliance, but I th that was in this system. That's weird. Combat bond office? That's weird. Okay, whatever. Let's see what they got here. Ooh, they got 12 ships. I want an eagle, cobra, orca. Oh, that'd be an awesome ship. <laughs> it's so dumb. Asp. I like how 6 million. That's a pretty decent price. Vulture, 4 million. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Python, 56 million, goddamn. It's very expensive. Drop your sidewinder, okay. Um, anything interesting in the bulletin boards? Oh, they want slaves. Well, they'll, they're only offering 40,000, that's really not great. Alright, let's go ahead and head out. Back on our quest towards the Leonard Nimoy station. And, uh, whatchamajigger. Uh, well, it's, I forget, forgot what the system, like LHS, something, something, something. Uh, the planet Vulcan, let's go with that. That's the name of it. Alright, look careful, don't boost. Don't boost. Gear oh, now you can boost. <laughs> I'm really tempting fate there. Oh boy, there's a planet in the way. My favorite. Oh god. Okay, so we're gonna think we're gonna have to supercruise around the planet. I know destination's obstructed. Okay. Just let me supercruise. Ah, uh, Rick Dicker. Ritik, love the videos. Keep up the good work. Thanks, buddy. I will. Let's send him a little, a little happy face. Oh my God! Yes, I am well aware. Okay, so what do I have to unlock the destination? Frame shift drive. Jeez. Four, three, three two, two, one. one. Engage. Okay, around the planet we go. Oh, let's relock destination. Alright. You slow down, man. What are you, the slow police? <laughs> oh, I forgot to refuel at that station. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, we got a fuel scoop, so hopefully we'll be able to use that. Though it's not the best one, I mean. Engage. Oh well. Oh uh, yeah, we'll probably do that around one of these planets. Probably do that off camera, I'll just orbit it for a little bit. Scoop up some fuel, because it's not super efficient, but hopefully it'll work just fine. Oh, hey there. You big red sun, you. Frameshift drive charging. Let's see, we have a lot of bounties. I mean, that's like, well, at least like 200,000. So, next time we're in Imperial or Alliance controlled space, uh, we'll have to remember Four. to pop in. Oops. One, engage. I'll have to remember to pop in and um, get those. Going to kill our speed. And, yep, end it here. I'll probably just uh, refuel around the sun and then we'll continue on our journey in the next episode. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.